Hey everyone, this is Andrew Ty and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna to show you how to download and install the Notion client on the M1 Apple Silicon Mac. So Notion is the note-taking software, which I find extremely good and I very much enjoyed learning how to use it. And today I'm gonna to show you how to get the client software to work. So of course we can actually go and use the web version of the software and it's fully functional. However, we'll be able to get better offline functionality and we're able to free up some browser tabs by downloading and installing the Notion local software. So I'm gonna leave a link to the Notion website. We're gonna to go to the desktop section here. If you're on the main website, you can just go to the download section and then click Mac and Windows. And we're gonna download the Mac version of the software. So if you're using a Mac with an Intel processor, this will be using Rosetta 2 and you'll need this version here. If you're using an Apple Silicon Mac, then you'll need to download this one here. You can tell which one you need by clicking on the top left-hand side of the screen and then clicking about this Mac. And then in this section here where it says chip, it'll say something like Apple M1 or Apple M1 Pro or Apple M1 Max. That means you have an Apple Silicon chip. If it says something like you have a core i3 or i5 or i7 Intel chip, then what you need to do is to download the Intel processor version. So here we're gonna download this M1 Apple Silicon Mac version and that's downloading now. Then we're gonna to go to Finder, then we're gonna to go to the Download section. And once that's files downloaded, we're gonna double click on the DMG file. Now that this is open, we're gonna click on Notion, and then we're going to hold and drag this into the Applications folder and then let go. Next, we're gonna to go to the Applications section here, and then we're gonna look for Notion. Once we've found Notion, we can go ahead and double click, and then click the Open button. Next, we're gonna log in with our account. If you haven't created an account already, you can go ahead and enter your email address and continue, or you can log in with your Google account or your Apple account. Here, we're gonna log in with my Google account, and here, we're gonna authenticate and type in my Google email address and password. So now I'm gonna allow this to open up Notion, and now I have the local software open. It's logged into my account and picked up all of the information that I've got on the online version of Notion. Here I can see that Notion is running as a native Apple ARM application and it's not using any Intel code or Rosetta 2 code. So now that Notion has been opened up, what I can do is just drag it onto the main taskbar so I can always find it, so that if I do quit out of it, I can always reopen it again very easily. And now this is fully installed. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. I've also got other Mac gaming and productivity tutorials on my channel. If you like the video, please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.